Hey folks, it's Frithgar here, how you doing? Welcome back to Two Point Hospital. That's all I've got, oh, wait a minute, no. I think I can move the desk so that I can get another one of these in here. I, I can't fit right across there, but I think what I can do is I can put one there like that and then get rid of that one and that desk put the desk right in there and then go for another traction bed still doesn't fit hmm I was hoping to be able to get two of these in here right we we, we just don't have the space do we it's, it's, li it's, it's just out on there just out on that corner is there a way that I can do this? If I turn you around, that one's not going to work. Not in there. Uh, it doesn't work that way. Put you down there a second, and then... That one... Right, it doesn't look like there is actually any way to get this to... Like, so I can't move that over any further. That one's over there as far as it can go. I, can I can't I can move the door over any further. The door has got to go there. This one here that is as tight as I can fit it into the corner. I can't put it that way round. I can only put it there. That's in the way of everything else if, if I drop it there. That's just not going to fit because it blocks them. So you've got to go right down into that corner like that, and then the traction bed, it just doesn't fit. There's not quite enough room to put that one in. So I'm going to have to leave that one. I will put a wall monitor in here, just to help them out a bit. I'll plonk that one on there. We will do some basics, like a medicine cabinet in here. Put that one in. Um... We'll have a toxic bin in here. We'll have a toxic waste bin in that one. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm really quite disappointed that I can't fit another one in. You know what, actually, I'm... Ooh. On the other hand, may, maybe I can if, if I box a little bit clever with this. Look, if I put that one there, you turn that round. No, that's not going to allow me to do that. Thinking maybe I could pop it into that corner. Oh no, there is maybe there is still hope. I can't put you in the. I can't put that one in there either. No. Huh? I had such high hopes for this. Okay, well that one's not going to work, so I'll get rid of that bit, and that one can go back over into that corner. I will take a fire extinguisher. Drop that down there. We'll take some hand sanitizer and put that on the wall. Uh, we'll have a radiator. That is quite important. That one can go over there like that. And we will put a plant in here as well. We'll have a plant in there. And then we will go with a food pyramid poster just there. And that will make level three. Okay. There is a small fracture ward. I need a nurse to run that one. I've got a doctor for that one. I need a new GP for that one. I've still got 47,000. So I will go to hire. I need a doctor. Now that doctor there is like... It, I've been advised that I should be getting doctors now with not much in the way of qualifications. And getting uh, using their specialist skills. I mean this guy is treatment. You've got research, which I've already got a doctor with research, but you've also got the G the general practice, the GP bit. So I'm going to take that, and then you can practice, you can do more GP stuff. So we will hire you. Thinks their life is a rom-com, constantly falling in out of love, and always smells good. Oh. So you can go oh. and work in there. So there's another doctor. I won't take a spare doctor at the moment, but I do need a nurse that will work in that room. So we want to go and have a look in the nurses. So this is a nurse with ward management, and I've also got diagnostics. Uh, treatment. I'll take a nurse with treatment. Heartthrob, argumentative, charming. You, unmotivated and a compulsive friar. Okay, I'm going to take you. That one right there. I've got ward management. 
emotional intelligence plus 10 percent happiness 10 percent treatment skill and stamina training that one would be quite good as well but i think sebastian is the better one that we, we will go with sebastian and he can work in the fracture ward over there so i've got a ward manager in there uh i've got two janitors is two janitors going to be enough for this? I mean, look at the number of people that are vomiting. I'm actually seriously considering getting another janitor, although these guys have got no qualifications at all. So maybe we should hold out on there. Assistants, I've got two. I probably don't need that many. Nurses, I want one nurse in there, one in there, one in there. Assistant nurse in there, and a nurse in there. So there's one, two, three, four, five nurses I need which I don't have, so I will get a spare nurse with the, um, she's also got, is she, well, she's unmotivated, she works slow. This one here, Luna Biggles, inspiring, she, stamina training, she's got 10% treatment, and she's got the ward management, so we can always train her for more ward training as well. Drop you in there, our money is getting a bit low. Right, so then I want to go over here to the learning courses. So I've got trainers, courses, trainees available. Here is my trainees. I've got, I got two assistants. I don't want to train them. But we've got doctor who could go for treatment, uh, a nurse for treatment, another nurse. If I was to do these two nurses for treatment, Jasper Longbottom is my research doctor. D is... The, ge the general practitioner. And then I've got this nurse here is ready for more ward management training. I would say we go... Right, select a trainee. I think we want that trainee right there. So this is seven courses available. And junior doctor? Hmm. I'm sort of... I want the, I want two nurses that will go for treatment skills. So we'll, we'll boost their treatment skills in particular. And then this doctor, do I want the doctor also trained in treatment skills? Is that going to really help me if I have uh, additional training in treatment skills? Uh, she's currently working in the GP's office. I don't have another doctor. Well, you're ready for training. In it. I am. I'm going to take you. Dr. D. Barton, you can also go in there. So I've got seven courses available. We can do diagnostics, bedside manners, uh, but it's treatment two that I would like. That one right there. Trainees now. I've also got the nurse here who's got the ward management. I was actually thinking ward management two would be a better one. That's 10% treatment skill. So we'll go, we'll specialize in treatment on those three. So I've got to get a trainer, which is you, which means I can't afford to do the training. So the doctor will leave off and we will train up the two nurses in here. That's going to give us the money to do it. That's all I can do is spend that. And that's going to help with the, the overall, I think. I'm hoping this is going to help with the overall. So that course has got 31 days to run. Let's see how this works. Let's see how this... Oh, the uh, items, hire, characters, staff, go into here, job, assignment. So you doing only research is not going to be much good at the moment. You can't really do anything else right now. So uh, you haven't had training there. I'll allow you to work the GP's office. I got two GP's office. So I'll allow him to work GP's. Just for a minute, and then we can decide on what else they're going to do. Now, I've got Ward Management 2 for Tiffany Muddles, so she is definitely not going to be working in the other wards. She is Fracture Ward. Pest Control, Surgery, not allowed. I've got two here for Treatment. They're going to be the Surgeons, so they won't be working in the wards. Those three there can work in the wards. You won't be working in the ward. What is this? Pharmacy, general diagnosis, no. Cardiology was a diagnosis one, and fluid analysis is diagnosis as well, isn't it? So I want these people working only in treatment. I don't have a clown clinic or chromotherapy. Most of these I don't actually have at the moment. So 
yeah, it, it, no, I don't have cardiology. I do have general diagnosis. Treat me. I suppose you could work in a ward. No, no, no. We won't. We'll. We'll. Let's. Let's not second guess ourselves too much. Let's allow things to just keep running. Janitors can keep doing what they're doing. Now I got four thousand coming in. I got this training course going on over here. I'm hoping I'm going to have. There's the doctor coming in. She's scrubbing up. So we're going to have that one going as well. At end of February. I've. I've got to be watching this for the end of February because that's when the money is about to plummet so I want to be able to get another member of staff I want another janitor I think that we do need three janitors I've got zero training on any janitors here so I got one janitor that is going to be just what are you maintenance you are motivated but startled by fog I think we'll take this one. She's already had a little bit of training with maintenance, which is going to help. But she can also help clean up the hospital, because this place is a pigsty, and we really, really need a janitor who can clean stuff up. Including people pooping on the floor. So we've got that one over there. Janitor required. Pick up. Call janitor. And call janitor. Let's get the toilets fixed so that people stop pooping on the floor. That would be a really, really good start. I got After patients leaving. After four rudderless years, Minus Two Point County has never been in greater need of strong leadership. So vote for four more years of Tabitha Winsock in the mayoral elections. Tabitha Winsock, wrong but stable. Wrong but stable. Wait, where's this the doctor? Is Two Point Radio. I had a doctor in here who was supposed to be coming in, and there she is. Could you really go for a break? I need you in here to do the treatment. Injection room required. Mood poisoning. A dangerous condition that causes the sufferer's health to deteriorate fast. Caused by paying too much attention to what other people think. This patient is seeking treatment. We will need an injection room in order to treatment. It will cost 15 grand. I do not have. Send patient home. Right, training course complete, treatment two. That's good. That means that we can at least start treating some of the patients that we've got right now. I've got a surgeon in here, and in comes a patient. I have not cured anybody yet. I've got four people waiting. We're down to 45,000, but this is good. If we can get some of these running through surgery, we're going to be able to make a bit of money. The Besides vomiting... The litter that you dropped on our floor... The vomiting is slightly concerning, but the janitors are now actually starting to get look at the number of people that are falling over on all of the vomit and the sick. This is awful. This is genuinely awful. Right, uh, inspection report, minus 15 rep. Mr. Jobsworth has sent us a report from his recent visit. It's 30 pages, so we haven't read it. But the conclusion reads just awful. More than just a terrible healthcare institution. A terrible place to be. I'm impressed that I can be this unimpressed. Congratulations. <laughs> Oh, this is terrible. The report didn't go well, but there's nowhere to go from here but up. Actually, I'm fairly convinced I could probably take us down to new lows. Patient is unhappy. I, we need a bigger surgery room. That's what we need. Staff resignation. Ugly environment. Very hungry. Desperate for the toilet. They've given us 90 days. Maintenance needed in the right. staff room. Nikki Champion. He needs to be made happier. The toilet's now working, which is a really good start. All right, that is a huge bonus. The toilets are working. The janitors are cleaning up the hospital as well, which is starting to look good. I've got one patient has been surgical. I've got another patient that is being surgical right now. Um, that's minus 48,000. The janitors are doing a good... I was right to get three janitors. New illness, crossbones. I did stop. Doctor discovered a new illness, crossbones. Skeletal rage, sometimes triggered by piracy. Requires a fracture ward. Okay. Fracture ward is busy. It's working. This is good. There is another patient who's been treated. So we've just earned 20 grand from the surgery. If she can change out, I'd like you to go in. Yes, excellent. The 
doctor is still going to be working and doing that. Some of our patients are dirtier than they'd like. We should really consider trying to keep the hospital less filthy. You can add sinks or placing um, sanitizer dispenser. Well done. We cured enough of the patient group. This has helped our reputation. We've sent a reward. Two out of four patients were cured. We've earned 10 grand from that one. That is awesome. I've got a patient waiting out here. I've got a patient on the table. 11,000 there minus. This, this is good. That surgery room is earning us all the money. And we're down to minus 40 grand. But that's about to get me another 20 in there. The janitors are really doing a great job. They are actually getting on top of the massive mounds of sick. I've got snack machines and they're going to need to be refilled. Happiness to 20. Mickey Champion, his happiness is going up. He should be, I'm hoping, having a break somewhere. If he's having a break somewhere, his happiness is going to go up. Patience is leaving. Well, I know the patients are leaving. Really need that morale to go up. Because if the morale goes up, I will also be able to train the staff and give them promotions, which is really good. That's what we need. He's up to 18, 19%. It's still climbing. Who's this? That's Sebastian Noir. D. Grant. And 19. He's going to get there, I'm sure of it. 20%. No! Oh, no. He's coming down again. Where is he? I've got to find him. Mickey Champion. Where is Mickey Champion? Samantha, Fredward, Mickey Champion, he's on a break. You go in here, dude. Take a break. You need it. His happiness has got to go up. His happiness needs to go up. Right, done. Okay, we, we've just managed to do it. Only just, though. He's literally just made it to the 20% that we needed. Uh, Mickey Hoofalum, head janitor, I don't know about you, but I find the relentless stream of death somewhat depressing. Do you think we could go a few months without any fatalities? Yeah, I do, because our reputation is so low at the moment that nobody knew is coming into the hospital, which is kind of a good thing. I've got a big queue of people outside this room. Uh, staff have training slots. Doctors have discovered a new illness. Floppy disks. A spinal discombobulation that leaves the sufferer with very limited... <laughs> Very limited memory. We'll send the patient for treatment in our surgery. Okay, that's good if we can send patients for treatment. You're on the air with Ricky Hawthorne. Well, actually, I'm the one who's on the air. You're just listening to me being on the air. You're listening to the air. Right, I've got a lot of very, very miserable people around here, but we're starting... please use the toilets provided. <laughs> yeah, we need you to use the toilets. Smack the Wizard has gained a lot of experience on the job. They'll be ready for a promotion as soon as I've got some money to do it. A doctor has discovered a new illness, hurty leg, caused by excessive physical activity and requires a fracture ward. I've got my fracture ward is busy, but I got nobody in here. My, my nurse that should be in here is not here. I don't know where she is. There's a lot of medical waste. You might need more jan- I got three janitors. Cleaning is for- They are actually getting on top of the medical waste that we've got. But it's- It's taking them a while to actually physically catch up with it all. This is a slight problem. So, they're getting there. This doesn't help. So, we will call a janitor to those two. Keep them running. I can just get a janitor in there. Yeah, there's another janitor. This dude is cleaning. The hospital is in debt. I'm doing it. I'm actually doing it. I am slowly, slowly getting on top of things. I know it's slow. It is very slow. I should have put some benches outside of here. Why have I not got a nurse in here? I've got no nurse required. I've got no nurse in here at all. You're looking for work. What have I done? What have I done? Fracture Ward. Luna Biggles, Tiffany Muddle, Sebastian Noir. Sebastian. Where is Sebastian? 
All right, Sebastian is working general diagnosis. And Tiffany is working. Oh, wait a minute. I've got two nurses working in here. No, extra staff. Right, don't have extra staff in here. That'll make a difference. Normal speed. Don't have extra staff in this room. Get Have one of them go out. Luna Biggles, you come out. Come down over here to the fracture ward. I'm hoping she's going to head down here to the fracture ward. Because I've got a few patients waiting to be treated in this room. So she can head in there. Yes, excellent. That is good. Uh, we want a pan extractor. We're going to need a few other sort of little bits like that really as well. That, that would be helpful. But... Okay, now I'm minus 68,000. This is getting bad. So what's my loans? Repay loan exempt. Loan. Why is that loan exempt? Requires a hospital of value 100,000 more. Some good advice from George Bristles, who sent in this quote. If at first you fail, be thankful that you have friends. Watching them fail too will make you feel better. He's right, you know. I'm not even allowed to get the bigger loans now. Right? They, they, they've just stopped me from having the loans. So I, I don't have that to look forward to. Staff promotion. Oh, right. We've actually got one who can be promoted. So he's more likely to treat patients. Promote. Go to fast speed. So I've gone and built this beautiful hospital. Surgery. Calling nurse. What is wrong with these people? Low hygiene sniffles too cold. Right. It's the low hygiene, I think. I think we need to actually have a sink in here to stop them from doing this. Mayoral visit. Impre <laughs> press the mayor. This, this isn't going to go well, is it? This is not going to go well. But less patients coming in, I'm guessing, might help us a bit. If we get less... What is with all... No, no stop! Yes, yes, Patient cure patients. Now arriving. We want surgical patients coming in. I've got a patient in there. Chromotherapy required. Send them home. Join me in welcoming the mayor to the hospital. Right, why can't I use other... I use money the from other hospitals. Sighted in the hospital. Right, why can't I use money from other hospitals? But, th I mean, this, these janitors are actually getting on top of her. And I've got three of them. Okay, excuse me. I just had a letter come up to say that nurse archive inbox. Where's my letters? Uh, anyway, I had a thing to say that nurse Fred would... Fredwood Derp can't get to where he wants to go. So I'm looking for a Fredwood Derp. Tiffany. Do you see a Fredwood Derp here anywhere? It's not you. No. Luna. Oh, there is a way to do that, isn't there? We go to staff over here. Uh, Fredwood Derp. Click on him right there. Wait, what? I don't understand. Where is Fredward Derp? What is this? Call a, oh, that needs to be restocked. So I will call a janitor over to restock that one. We call the janitor in to restock that one there, and where is our Fredward Dup? Why can't he get to where he wanted to go? Sebastian. This is weird. It's like he's disappeared. Fredward Dup. It's not you. He's this dude right here. He's on a break on call. I don't get it. it. Says he's not. Right. Well, let me try it from this angle, maybe. Oh, there he is. So where are you try? Right. I've got, I've got a question mark thing on him. Why have I got a question mark thing on him? What's going on here? 
But look at this room. Edit. Uh, do I need to... Maybe I can put this fire extinguisher somewhere else. I can't put it over there. I can't put it between any of these. Right. That should work. I've got two bins in this room. I don't want two bins in this room, do I? So I will get rid of... Well, actually, I don't need to get rid of that bin. I can put the bin there. And then I can move that one over there. Like that. Yes, stop editing this room. Oh, cancel editing this room. I don't want to cancel editing this room. I want to edit the room. I want to move that bin over to there. I want to move that one over to there like that. And then tick so that it says done. And then do that because it will chuck them all outside the room for a minute. And then the patient has just gone and died. Lara Chump has died. We've got ghosts coming in. I've got dead plants everywhere. But I do have janitors that are now actually looking like they're getting on top of everything. I'm minus $100,000. What I'm actually thinking is over here I should have another surgery room. That would be quite a handy thing to have. I need a doctor in here. Where is the doctor for surgery? That's who I'm waiting on. Fredwood Derp is looking for work. Right, you are my surgeon. But you're also the only person I got for psychiatry, which is not very good at all. So you're going to have to go in there, and I've got 47 days. I haven't done anything in here yet. This is not helpful. But I've got... You're working in there, and you're treating patients, and then I've got patients that will be able to be treated in here. So when he comes... He's going to have that one treated. Nurse Fred with derp something. What was that? I didn't actually see that. Challenge. Cure 10 patients. We'll see if we can do that. So, well, what? Uh, where's, where's Fredwood? Fredwood derp is looking for work. He's wandering around aimlessly an awful lot. I'm not quite sure what he's supposed to be doing. The... Patients are now getting through all of these. We've got the, the, the janitor's thing over here. That's, that's not working. The toilets are working. Injection room required. Get uh, Send them home. Wow. Impress them with a nice hospital. Well done. Establishments like yours make the mayor's job easier. Increase her approval. And oh yes, are good for the people of the county. Wow. Right, I genuinely didn't expect that with all the dead people. But look, the janitors. We'll be right back. The janitors are actually getting on top of all of the sick. We're, we're, we're slowly making a bit, of pro a bit of progress. I've got a bit of training right there. Staff promotion right there. Junior nurse to nurse. Promote. Uh, we're 93 grand. I need to keep working on this. Don't... Oh, no. The, the, the only surgeon I've got is now going on a break. I need another surgeon. She's going to be on a break for weeks now. 15 days she's now on a break. I've got to get another surgical doctor. How can I do that? I mean, I've, I've, I've got you in here with diagnosis. And you're working it, but we're not covering costs. View. Okay. I'll let this run. Open all. Employer of the Year and Rising Star. Well, I think that's quite enough care and loving attention inflicted upon the patients from myself for today. So we will return next time. In the meantime, if you have enjoyed this episode, then could you please head down below and give us a like. And if you really enjoyed it, then please tell your friends all about me. Get them to come and watch as well. That would be awesome. And until next time, thank you very much for watching. This is Frithgar. Goodbye and see you later.